latest from Bukit Koman, school gas exposure level twice of industrial standards. Environmental group Bukit Koman Anti-Cyanide Committee today revealed that the permissible hydrogen cyanide level set by the Department of Environment at its air monitoring stations is a lot higher than it should be. Upon inspection of daily records from 12 January to 20 January, the group found that cyanide was detected in the air almost every minute, peaking at 1.11 parts per million by volume. What's more worrying, Bukit Koman Anti-Cyanide Chairman Wong Kin Hun says the Department of Environment has set the permissible limit of hydrogen cyanide at 10 parts per million, double the industrial standards, which is set at 4.7 ppm. Chemical expert and the group's advisor, Than Ka Keng, says the permissible limit should be at least 10 times less than that of the industrial standard. If we have a limit, for example, uh, uh, 4.7 for workers in the factory, for the public, usually it's at least 10 times less. Uh, yeah. At least 10 times less, depending. And then we also look at children. So we have three issues here. First thing, there's uh, something wrong with the uh, safety limit. So called, there's so, sorry, not safety, but permissible level. We always talk about permissible. It's not safe. Than then clarifies that he is not opposed to mining, but if it is going to be done, the safety of the surrounding residents should be a priority.